everyone, and welcome to another episode of the Sports Factory Podcast. Before we even start the podcast, make sure to like this video and make sure to subscribe. We got some big goals. We're trying to hit 700 subscribers by the end of this month. So make sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also, make sure you buy you a Shangoon jersey. Very important to get you a Shangoon jersey. I'm going to tell you a little look, Mauricio. I'm going to start. I got to start off like this because I haven't had a lot to talk about in a good way for the Rockets in a long time. And that's just being honest, right? The Rockets lose a lot of games. They've been mediocre for many years. But when he just when he dropped off Wemby, do you know how good I felt, bro? You know how good that you know you know you know how that made me feel, bro. The nigga dropped. I, 45 I can imagine points. forty five points, fifteen rebounds. He had five steals. I don't know where them five steals came from. That's just that's that's an extra thing that he just did. Five steals, bro. I'm, I'm gonna tell you a little. And Wemby was getting all the hype in the world. Now Wemby's still a great player. He probably, he might win. He might win Defensive Player of the Year. You never know. He might win that. I don't know. But bro, Shane Goon dropping that man off, and bro, look, look, I, I got, I, I, there's like so many animations. There was one animation he hit on freaking Wemby, boy, Wemby was, and he did a little dunk right after that, boy. I, I got, I got, I got to put it up. I'm gonna pull that up, Mauricio. You wait right there. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna I put know it up. What you're about. <laughs> <laughs> don't you move. You don't you move. But hey, look, Greg, I know you a Rockets fan as well. Tell me, like, you know that moment that how, how'd that feel for you, bro? That's his career high, bro. Like, how's man, that feel? For you, bro? Look, that boy Shane Goon said, move that hand. He said, move that hand. Stop running. Yo, Shingun was going crazy. Actually, all of the Rockets, for real, that, that whole game, like, it was it was nice. The fact that Wimby, he had, like, that nice little moment where he blocked Shingun and then came back, you know, and started tween-tweening. And mm-hmm. shot that three, and I was like, okay, I, I see what kind of game it was. He did not have another shot attempt the whole second half. He didn't even attempt a shot. That's a crazy thing. Um, Some people are going to be like, ah, moment was too bright, or they're just gonna be like, yo, Shingun really had that man in, in hell. But I mean, either or, that, that's he just got to get stronger, man. Uh, Wimby, Wimby will get better, but he's just got to get stronger, bro. Stop playing like F a, F a better. I don't want him to get better. I want him to be, look, look, look. I'm, I got the Wimby killer right here, boy. Okay, look, <laughs> now look, look. Now I get, I get the steal. I get the steal. Oh my god. Now, show, now, now he get down there. Okay, give me the ball. Watch it. Whoop. Oh boy, that now that's skill, boy. I was like, oh boy, that's some Jokic type B. Okay, now watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Okay, get, come on. You and me. You and me. No, try to block me. Try to block me. No. Psych. He's a little, little, little style to have his legs out. Give me some more. Come on. Come here. You two. Two weak. Both the outside. Mine. Simple. That's easy. beautiful, boy. That's easy, man. That's fool. You know, when, <laughs> when I put that out, the very next video that was up was Wemby. 30-minute Wemby highlights saying why he's the future of the NBA. They will trying to get some freaking narrative put on me when I'm trying to watch Shangoon. I'm like, bro, if you don't get that out of my freaking way. Now, look, Risha, I would tell you, um, regardless of Shangun dropping your guy off, Wemby has played well. Um, he is in the running for Defensive Player of the Year, right? Mm-hmm. I believe Rudy Gobert will win Defensive Player of the Year because he's like the safest person to ever just give Defensive Player of the Year. And he's also a great defender as well. And the Minnesota Timberwolves are like a top three seed, but they lost their guy, Carl Anthony Towns, because, of course, they have no plot. And, you know, I just I saw, you know, something like that going to have to happen. But, um, Risha, I just I just tell me, Two things. Number one, how did it feel when Shangun dropped you off? But no, and the number two, <laughs> <laughs> number two, uh, do you think Webin Yama can actually win defense player to you? Um, well, first off, in the game, it's um, I mean, I was watching it, but it uh, it was a questionable source, so I was uh, in and out, uh, so I didn't get to watch the whole game, you know, <laughs> at once, and maybe maybe for the better. Um, I mean, yeah, like. Shingun and, and the Rockets got their lick back. Um, I think they're two and one on the season against the Spurs. So I got one more game at AT and T. So um, you know we'll see how we'll see how they end it. Um, as a fan, it makes me excited for the future. Um, wow. Just Shingun because of the um, not 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 Shingun's performance, just. Just okay, the, that, the rivalry, <laughs> just the the rivalry aspect. I think that's, I think that's good. It's uh, you need you need those, uh, you know th- those rivalries to really pop up because uh, I think it, it elevates the game. You know, you're more invested without having to become invested in another way. Like for example, gambling. Um, there you go. So I, I think it's uh, I think it's healthy. I think it's a uh, Great, and I think this is going to be the 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 matchup of the future for 
uh, at least Wemby. I know people talk about Chet um, and nothing against Chet, but I mean, I think this is going to be the true rivalry in in our division. Um, I mean, y'all, maybe y'all in the West. Y'all started. I mean, yeah, he did start, and that's. I, I, didn't I, I was. I was, was going to mention that. Um, I, I think that's probably a reason why the Rockets will always play against Wemby harder than probably any any other team, and it's so just natural. <laughs> why he do that? Like he, yeah, he yes, like what, what, like bro, the Hornets, bro, he didn't do that like with the Hornets. Like when the Hornets come up, I thought he say some yes too. Like yes, he didn't go to Hornets. He do with the Rockets. I said, but that's cool. That's, that's cool. That. But I'm gonna remember that. That's that Steven Silas text though. You know what I mean? <laughs> Like, Boy, Steve, Steve Silas was gone. We had Udoka. Yeah, was but, we, but we didn't. Yeah, it, it was. I understand, but this rivalry was finna happen regardless. Like we've been itching for this rivalry to like really be a, a It hasn't. It hasn't really been a real rivalry since Kawhi was there, mm-hmm. and even then, like it still didn't have that same hype because like Kawhi don't talk. Yeah, he's just into, yeah, a, into just a degree. Ball. Into a degree, we lost don't really very sad, talk, but he did enough. Yeah, and he all, did enough to piss me. All we need is a as a rocket. Like, yeah, like Wemby yeah. is is way more subtle about it. Um, he wasn't subtle that day, but <laughs> that man was happy. <laughs> he was not subtle at all. <laughs> Overall, <laughs> he's more, he's more subtle about it. But I mean, I still obviously, you know, Wemby is an alien, so yes. So I, I'm I'm still confident. You know, he's is is a rookie. In the NBA, um, you're gonna have those moments. Um, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I mean, look, <laughs> I mean, look, I mean, Joel and B had his career high on Wimby, so it's you know. Oh, it, is he a center liability? Is he a liability against centers? I'm sorry. I don't know, man. I'm, I'm not sure. I think, like I said, he's gonna have to get into that gym um, because yeah. Shingun is a strong dude. Um, if people don't understand. Jonas Valanciunas had to miss six to eight weeks because when he was backing down, um, when Shingun was backing down Jonas Valanciunas, he actually um, chipped uh, Jonas's rib rib cage a little bit, so he had to sit out. The dude's strong. I think he's underrated. He has like that grown man strength, so it doesn't look he doesn't look brolic like Giannis. But I mean, look, every everybody from the Europeans, they just they're just unnecessarily strong, but just don't look yeah. like like Jokic and all them other people. So. He'll learn. I tell you. Yeah. I tell I mean, you one thing. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead, one, one more thing. I'll, I'll mention about that. I mean, Wemby put a he put up uh, twenty pounds of I'm uh, obviously muscle yeah. in the off season, and that was one off season with the Spurs. So I think. Um, but twenty any, more next off. Twenty more. Thirty yeah. more. Me too. Twenty every every off season. You <laughs> gain twenty. <laughs> twenty next week. Thanks. So that day. But he's still we'll mobile. I know y'all probably seen that clip of him uh, tweaking his ankle, and it was like nothing happened. He like landed awkward, and his ankle like yeah. kind of yeah, almost yeah. fully. So, and he was like still he didn't have to hardly miss any time for that. So, so yeah. I, I'll tell you. Um, and John, I know it's been a while since he watched Rockets basketball. Um, we're not. This is not the time to start. I mean, now you probably don't really care for that. I would say wait, like wait, 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 look, wait about two years, maybe. I don't know till till we get like really relevant, um, because it, it's it's steps to trying to get to be relevant again. The Western Conference is a freaking bloodbath, so there's no there's no path for me to make it into that. This you know right now, um, but as long as you find your guy, first you find your guy Shangun, second you find your identity. I don't know what that is yet. Defensive team, uh, offense team, a three point shooting team, free flowing. I don't know what the identity is yet. We'll we'll learn about that. Just a bunch of young guys trying to figure their way out. And um, when you get that, then hopefully you get some plot. And that's how you win. You finally get those three, and that's how you win in the NBA. So we're at step one, I believe. We gotta wait till step two and step three. But um, to divert to talk about a couple of people who are in those steps. I was curious. I, I just know. Haven't done this list. We did this list for football and the quarterbacks. Just curious if we could do this list in basketball. Who is your current top five NBA players right now? Mm. And this is something to really think about. Now, I, I have half mine. I think I have mine. I'm gonna throw mine out. I'll go. I'll go with it. So number you, one, <sighs> what? No, what you about to say? Now you know what's crazy. What? I can't name a starting five. For any team, 
Like, I can't name the starting five players for any team in the NBA. Yeah, like, yeah I don't. You, you guys just yeah. yeah you don't need. Rockets. You just need the top five. You just don't need a starting five. You need the top yeah. five in the league. No, no. I'm just saying in general. <laughs> I, I, was, I was as you said that. I just thought about. It. I was like, man, who my top five? And I was like, I can't even name the starters on the Rockets. I mean, I probably would. Jalen Green, Fred. Yeah, I mean, two, two. I mean, you could, you, <laughs> there's nothing. The other guy, you could, you could, uh, he's it. the best player. You could, just, you could say Shane Goon. That would have been. Uh, he said, "Yeah, two out of three, two out of five. Uh, oh, and Dylan yeah. Brooks. Yeah, I mean, I, I bet on the Rockets a lot. Well, that makes four sense. to five. There you go, four to five, bro. That's good. That's freaking good. What the other one? Jabari Smith. Jabari Smith. Mm. I heard. Of and him. simple enough. He said, you "I heard." <laughs> hey man. I'm always a little pissed that we didn't get Paulo. Paulo balling in Orlando, eight or four seed. And I'm just Jabari ain't bad, but he not. Bro, like Paulo is, yeah, that's tough. They said he's coming to us, and then all of a sudden they switched last second. So stupid. I hate that type of shit. My top five. <laughs> I'm gonna start off. No, I'm gonna start off with Giannis. I'm put Giannis one. I put Jokic very close number two. It's almost interchangeable. But I'm putting Jokic number two. Number three, um, healthy. He's not healthy right now, but I'm. You know, healthy version of him. I'm putting Embiid number three. Um, I'm putting Luca number four, and um, number five always hard because there's a lot of guys. But hey, Butler. I might give him. Nah, that's hilarious. Butler, <laughs> Butler, think Butler postseason Butler. Yeah, but them boys are they meddling right now. But obviously they waiting for that moment. But it's just I need I need to see like these are MVP guys, and Shea's been killing it. I don't know should I put Shea or Jason Tatum? Yeah, Shea. Shay's Crazy. been killing. He, they don't. They don't want right now. And Tatum been. He been doing it for Tatum. a while. And Tatum, but Tatum, I might. I put Jason Tatum five because them boys aren't like on like an historic streak right now. They did lose to Cleveland the other day on some stupid stuff, but like they are, they are a team that can win like 64, 65 games. And I think they said they editor. There's like a, I don't know if y'all seen this edit with like they shooting they shooting threes and it's like it it is like whoever did the edit he 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 a hall of famer too he's 20 years old but he a hall of famer too they say dang he got a super team and a super editor them boys got everything in boston so but i you know i can see i can see that plot falling out though i know i can see that plot <laughs> it sets up perfectly for a freaking meltdown but that's gonna be my top five Giannis, Jokic, and bead luca jason tate okay um all right um, I'll go. I'm gonna put Jokic at the one. Uh, Giannis two. Luca three. Jason Tatum four. Shea Gill just five. Um, <laughs> Embiid is just yeah. not that's, on my that's list. my list as well. Um, exactly. Oh, exactly. Avail- your list. Availability is the best ability for yeah. me. I would rather have Jason Tatum on my team. Than Joel Embiid. There has not been a single season where Embiid has not been unhealthy or healthy, whatever. He's all he's injury prone. Um, so at least at least Jason Tatum might have a chance. Um uh, by the time the playoff starts for Embiid, there's always something happening with this man's knee, foot, or back, and I'm yeah. tired. Send his ass. I, I put I put him high because like those top three have been the MVPs. Since James Harden's MVP, like what remember, you? like if y'all you go back to remember James Harden won MVP, right? I remember that clearly. Hey, Ever James. since James Harden won MVP, is one of those three players: Giannis, Giannis, Jokic, Jokic, MVP. That's what it's been. That's fair. So He's in top- my mind, I'm like, those are the guys every year. Who's the top three in MVP? Last couple years, the top three MVP is literally those three players every single time. Mm-hmm. Obviously, this year not because you know he's hurt. But when he was playing, he was the MVP. And Bede was averaging 36. He was on some James Harden time. Oh, yeah. He, he, was, he was clear runaway. He was clear runaway this year. Um, he was going to win it. He was going to win it and lose in the second round like he always does. <laughs> but, hey, collect, hey, I'll tell you like this. It's like that Westbrook stuff. Bro, collect your trophies, bro. That's what I need. I was like, collect. During that Warrior run, I was like, collect them trophies, all the trophies you can. Curry and Durant can't collect any right now. They together. So you can't get no MVP. They can't get no MVPs. So collect those MVPs. That'll help your legacy. Maybe they break up one day. Maybe you got a shot. But I don't think nobody – They well, they still don't got no chance. They got no plot still. They together now, too. That's funny. Um, John, what you think? <laughs> what do you think? I like that list. But I'm a uh, Jokic. I'll put him one. Uh, shit, two through five. I'm going to put Jimmy Butler at five. Because I you you have to include the playoffs. Like, are we are we just doing regular season? Are we doing top five <laughs> overall? 
Because we're doing top five yeah. overall. Like he he takes it to another level in the postseason. And that's when I watch. So I'm and it's not like one season he did it. Uh, it's been season after season. And are they in the playoffs right now? As of now? They the AC boy. The another AC. run coming. <laughs> Look at that. That's, right, that's, that's hey, a sweet spot. Go. And, hey, <laughs> right where they that's right where they spot. need to be. Low seed and about to knock all these top teams off. So I got Jimmy Butler at five. Mm, the rest, you know, I don't. I, I'm I'm not a fan of Giannis. So because uh, yeah, yeah, back, back with my boy James Harden was my boy. So you know, uh, but I respect his game. So I mean, you can put him at four. I'll put Luca at three. Damn Curry at two. Simple enough. Stuff, nah, he, nah, he hell, make nah. hell no. Nah. He oh, no. he missed like nine threes that one game. Nah, I, yeah. <laughs> I had him on my parlay, so nah, nah. Take scratch that. <laughs> Give me uh. I mean, I I do like Tatum. I don't know if he's balling right now, but I do like Tatum. There we go. So so it's Jokic, Tatum. I'm forgetting the three. Who's number three? I know Giannis number four like and Bowen number five. Luca. Yeah, Luca. Luca. Right. So what? Oh yeah, I, I'll tell you. He this. always hit on parlays. I tell you, Lewis. <laughs> Lewis hates Tatum. Like he hates Tatum a lot. So I just remember that's that hilarious. One year he he, he matched <laughs> LeBron. I was like, damn. That was his rookie year too. It was his rookie year. He matched on I LeBron. Wanna, I was like, damn, what is this kid? I want to rock I mean, himself. To me, he's been. I, I like I consistency. To me, he's been consistent. Like throughout his, I, I well I know like in like he have up and down games, but like on a totality level, he's he's mm-hmm. been consistently good to me. From what I see, and maybe this- I'm not like watching, and I'm not keeping up during the regular season. So if he's like selling everybody, I don't know. But nah, them boys I like Jalen Brown too, though. I like you know. He 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 got cooked in that last postseason. Yeah, that left hand thing. Get, yeah, but <laughs> he got cooked. But, but he got cooked. Uh, the NBA yeah, man, that man, that man, can, that man can't dribble with his left hand. Oh yeah, yeah, he can. Uh, yeah, I remember now. He can. And then he, he dunked, dunked it with the left and It didn't change anything. Yeah, that dunk. Oh, was was that against Kai? Was was that over Kai? Right. Um, uh, I think so. Not only was it over Kai, but he was sitting down. That now that was. <laughs> I hit it the he did the um I don't know he did the, he did yeah. I don't know, he dab or something at the end of the <laughs> I'm not gonna lie that day <laughs> it was like the callback to whoever did it I forget his name but he did it like he covered his eyes yeah after, like as he jumped not after he dunked so it was just like it, he didn't even do it right the <laughs> the dunk contest is like extremely hard it was like because yeah. I mean, at yeah, some I, point they. They just got to get rid of it because creativity, like, what else can you create? There's only so much the human body can do. It, it, but I, I'm happy he did it, though. I'm happy he did it because that's the best player that's done it in many years. Who? It's like player. Jalen Brown, the best player who's done Like Jalen Brown. Like last year, it was oh, G yeah. League. A bunch of it was G, a bunch of people I don't remember besides the, the winner. And then the year before, they had Jalen Green, Cole Anthony. That was a terrible one, but Jalen Green had me cringing. But he had the NFT on, and <laughs> exactly. he missed so many times. Little baby was trying to look on his phone. Cream left. I said I had to change the channel, but I said I can't watch this. No, I, that that hurt. But I was like, well, I can't. <laughs> you, didn't I, change, you didn't change the channel for Jalen Brown? No, look, look. We do the live streaming that, so there was no change the channel. We we watching oh, it. You had Jalen no ch- Green, yeah. but Jalen Green is a Houston Rocket that I was hoping to be very successful, wow. and I was literally judging his plot. Off of that dunk contest, I was like, if he did something crazy in that dunk contest, he won. I was like, oh, this guy, he gonna be something good for us. Maybe Zach Levine type trajectory, I don't know, but he'll be good. But you see that dunk contest he had, I said, oh no, he never gonna get up. That, like he never gonna be good for us because of that. That dunk contest was so awful. I had to change the channel. That's tough. Yeah, like, and, yeah that no, I don't think any rocket should be in a dunk contest within the next four years. Like, yeah, they be trying to put Cam Whitmore. No, I don't want that because I thought, I thought. KJ Martin was gonna come out and at least do something better than what he did. He came in with that 3D printed basketball and ruined my fucking oh. night. Oh yeah, <laughs> was that last year? It was garb- yeah, I think it was. I think it was last year. Yeah, we, 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 we put a lot of people. We put a lot of people in there. We, be we, put, don't do we be put mediocre in there, thinking we, we, we disappoint every time. No, now one person I, and Jalen Brown don't never need to do that no more, bro. I don't. We don't have to do that. Now Zion out here saying, "Yo, if I make the All Star game, 
I'll do the dunk contest. I'm gonna need him to drop 40 pounds before you even think about doing something <laughs> like that. Because quite frankly, I just don't think this is the same creative Zion that I met at Duke. Um, this man has a child now. This man um is is a is a BBL warrior. You know what I mean? Like he's not he's just catching lobs at this point. You know, when the last time you seen him do an athletic block? It's just, you know, we used to awe at this man doing if you look up some Duke highlights, man. It's crazy. Bro, you you understand really quickly. Oh man, this man really did used to look like generational talent. He's still good. But it's not the same Zion. We just settling for this version of Zion. This version of Zion is good. And we was looking for greatness. Um, I don't want to see him in a dunk contest until, you know, he looked like Duke Zion. Because I, that, that doesn't move the needle for me. You got some, New Orleans got some good food, so I don't know about that. He's <laughs> never. Gonna... <laughs> that one off his chest. <laughs> it was garbage. Was thinking cool. about that. Yeah, Mariah Mills is insane. I don't know why he did that. That was yeah, a great summer to talk about. That was a lot. That summer, that was a lot. And that was entertaining. Oh, I was reading every tweet she had. But that was... CJ be winning. <laughs> so C- much content. CJ went for. No, hey, that's... No, we not in football season. I ain't going to talk about that. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> he, you, why, like you said, you uh, went for her. It's like, you know. Uh, that's <laughs> but that's neither here nor there. And and she's... Yeah, we, we, had, a, we had a pot about that. <laughs> Yeah, Zion, Zion was great for content. CJ was great for content. Everybody, it, it was a great summer. If you was running low on topics for your podcast, those were layups. Yeah. John Morant, another layup. It was a great summer. Yeah. That was another topic. I, I didn't have to think too hard um, this past summer. And Wemby, that was a bunch of topics. Wemby, getting a hold for Wemby, that was a bigger topic. Kai Jones, yeah. Kai Jones dunking on Wimby. Oh man, that was a two week parlay. Oh, 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 I was talking oh. about that. Some, but I was talking about that. But I was watching all these Wimby uh summer league games. But I was talking about that. Obviously, it didn't matter though. But bad, <laughs> bad, bad Scoot Henderson games. Oh yeah, I was out here pushing pushing takes like crazy. Damn, the next Emmanuel Moody. Eh? Damn, that's crazy tough. That's crazy. I, was for Scoot. I thought Scoot, I thought Scoot's gonna be special, and then like I mean, he still may be special, but it, it's 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 a rough start. I'd say the only, the biggest take the biggest moment I remember from last summer is when I didn't get Wemby. I was watching that draft lottery and they picked me fourth and my heart, like you actually felt it in my heart. Like my heart <laughs> dropped. That I went to four. I was, I just wanted at least to be top three or two. When I got to four, that made me very sad. But I had a whole TikTok of me almost like looking over the ledge. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <I'm> like <laughs> it was yeah, that, that, that was interesting. That, that was a lot of content for that summer. Um, but I did want to talk about this as well, considering that. Going back to the Celtics real quick. They are the NBA super team at the moment. I remember like two weeks ago or last week, we talked about what superstar got carried, right, in history. I'm curious now, though, if you can look at the teams now, if a superstar player or the number one player on the team vanished, every number one player on the team vanished, what would be the best team in the NBA besides the Celtics? Because obviously that's the very easy answer. Take away the Celtics. <laughs> what team would be the best? Clippers. Now, I'm... I'm, I'm he said, without Jimmy Butler, the team would still be good? Oh, my God. Yeah. That's insane. Nah, nah, you're right. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> That's insane. Hey, um, he top five for a reason. Um, So, take away Giannis from the Bucks. How they doing? So, it's Damian Lillard and no defense. And Doc Rivers. That's tough. <laughs> Doc Rivers. That's tough. Yeah. No. Yeah, Doc Rivers. No, we, we got, what? How long he been in uh, NBA? What, 13 years? Lillard? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. It's One beard grown. Portland, there you go. You say you say the Clippers. The so Clippers. you take away Kawhi Leonard. I mean, they plot. I I just see. I know it should be, but like they plot is so awful. You know, what about what about the Suns? What about Devin Booker? Devin Booker and Bradley Beal. What about them? Take I mean, Bradley Beal barely played now. You still got um, KD. No, KD gone. So KD, KD vanished. Gone, so all you have is Devin Booker and Bradley Beal. That's not oh, what he, okay, okay. You said no, Katie better that's, than Booker. That's not that's not what no, you're not gonna get the top team in the NBA NBA. You're right? not you're not getting past Denver without um uh, Jokic. But no, but no, but <laughs> yeah, not, so, like so Jamal. Jamal Murray, you saying Jamal Murray yeah. and Michael Porter is gonna beat Devin yeah. Booker and Bradley Bill? Yeah, Bradley Bill can't uh, even stay on the court now. It really is just gonna be Devin Booker. Bro, Jokic being away from that team is a very like that shoots a lot of like there th- he is an offensive machine and that's just gone i, I don't know that's that's okay. a lot to be gone the Jokic, did he play in the bubble yes he did yeah oh, okay 
Um, um, I, mean, the bubble, I remember more Jamal going crazy. I don't know. He, yeah, he had he had a great he had that great Jokic. first round against Utah for sure. He did have that great last first round. year. I but remember this, Jokic but, like being the but this Jokic this is this year, but this Jokic is the bubble, much he, better than that Jokic. He, I, did he? Who carried more in the bubble? I think it was still even. I think first was round even? was Murray. Second round it was like I don't. I'm Jokic not gonna lie. I don't talking. remember like Jokic being. Like, I don't remember like a game or a series. I was like, damn, Jokic going crazy. Now it last was, year, it wasn't, it wasn't a, last year he yeah I was like they can't. But, but that's stop. how you taking away you but you taking away that. Yeah, but you I don't take away checking, I, don't, I don't see nobody checking Jamal for real. Like like I've yet to guess, see nobody uh, like they got Jamal. good role players. Yeah, like they got they yeah. got yeah. Uh, Aaron Gordon, Michael Porter Jr. Like Michael, I never passed Porter Jr. You know what I mean, like. There's some, there's, there's some, there's some different pieces out there. What's his name, uh, I forgot the other guy name. He pretty clutch. The one that came from the Lakers. Oh, KCP. Yeah. KC, yeah, KCP. He played oh, solid right. last year. Going off last year, he played solid. So. Christian Braun. Uh, <laughs> I just Brown. Brown Jordan. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I like them. Uh, nah, so, but what about the, look at the Lakers. What about the Lakers? So who's the best players? Anthony Davis or is it LeBron? It's Braun. Um, that's, 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 that's very sad. That's very sad, actually. Um, sad, and so Anthony, Anthony sad and impressive, though. Yeah, Impressively but, sad. No, but Anthony Davis really <laughs> come on, bro. Like Anthony Davis needs to be. It's not even like impressive in sense of like Anthony Davis playing really great and LeBron's playing greater. It's just like Anthony Davis not playing as good as he should, and LeBron's playing good. Yeah, maybe this is kept They're out. not going nowhere. They're not. They can't go nowhere without LeBron, honestly. So, AD AD's not going. Eddie's not gonna turn it up um without getting injured. So no, then they're not they're not the best. What, about the, what about the Knicks without Jalen Brunson? Julius uh, Randle, boy, he all star, boy. That was an all star. You no, know, we see lottery, how they they, they, they always end bad. So that's a lottery yeah. team right there. Uh okay, or the or the Knicks, Kings they, without they Aaron the Fox. The Kings without the Aaron Fox, I I might hey they they will still Sabonis be Sabonis falling. They will Sabonis. still be competitive. Sabon is good. Sabon is lead the league in triple doubles and double doubles. And I'm a fan of Keegan Murray. I think Keegan Murray will still be fine. He'll be cool. Um, Man, Mavericks being a lottery, though. Mavericks being a lottery. But um, Luka? Ma- yeah, Kyrie Memphis. Not doing that, bro. No, yeah, the Mavericks are awful without Luca. And uh, Memphis, Memphis without, right uh, it's, it just is what it is. He has, it's what they are. I don't know. Lottery team. <laughs> but <laughs> but, the, but at the same time, they're also playing teams that don't have their player as well. So it changes. <laughs> they, may, they may get more wins off of just that. Um, so uh, the, like you, you can say we can say the Clippers. The problem with the Clippers, they have such a collection, a collection of such awful plot. I mean, you look, you got James Harden, Russell Westbrook, and Paul George. That fire. is some tough plot. No, you say fire that plot rough. They find a way, they'll find a way to lose the like you, you have a team with the, like a better system but less talent. The less talent team somehow is gonna finesse that. I feel like the Nuggets might finesse that and beat the Clippers anyways. Especially like game six, game seven, James Harden, which is rough. In game six, game seven, Russell Westbrook, who was also rough. And Paul George, I always remember the man hits the side of the backboard in that freaking game seven. Yeah. That's also rough. It's all rough. Kawhi Leonard, the only one with plot there, so I don't know. But uh I see what you Paul George clutch up last year. Paul George, Paul, I think Paul George was injured last year. I don't think he played in the playoffs. I don't, yeah, I don't recall Paul George playing. Really yeah, he wasn't one year. What did he, oh, he clutched up uh, the year after the bubble. He had a yeah. good year. Yeah, twenty one. Yeah, yeah, twenty twenty one. He he clutched up for sure. He, play, he played better. That was his one post. Like yeah, the last time, his, uh, pandemic P and gave him playoffs. Yeah, they were, yeah they removed the pandemic, <laughs> but then the problem was Kawhi was hurt, so it was really just Paul George yeah. by himself for real. That, that was the year to win too. That's how I know they ain't got no plot. No, Kawhi Leonard, you should stay in Toronto. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. The, that 2019 Toronto team is always just gonna be like a wonderful memory for me. That's a great college memory for me. It's and good they, he they, left, they, huh? but why? Because they weren't gonna recreate that. They don't have to look. I feel you like they get plot the one in, and yeah, unless you can recreate, just move on. Now, but the Raptors they were, never they were good. You say they what? Were pretty good. The Raptors were pretty good. I believe they're pretty good the next year. They just didn't have they star. They lost to the Celtics because they just didn't have they closer. But it was Quite so magical. Like I don't. That's the only thing I want to remember. 
Yeah, I don't, I don't want to be dated. That's, that's that's <laughs> it was a great story. I would hate for it to get tarnished. That's like that's like when movies and, and series like try to make like a sequel. Yeah, they force it. Or, yeah, like the they, they clearly want to just keep them back. Like they're like, you know what? You go to LA, bro. We don't want you, bro. We don't want to ruin what we had. That little bit moment we had. They definitely would resign that man for all the money in the world. He yeah, went to I mean, I, of course they would, but I'm just saying, like as an NBA fan. Like, just leave on a high note. It's okay to I leave like on a high note. Look at, look at this Clippers career, bro. It is rough. I it mean, is. yo, like, <laughs> it's rough, boy. I mean, that that was his last moment. That That's that's tough. But uh, So we're saying, are we saying, you know, Greg, you said Clippers. Are we all agreeing Clippers? Is that the easiest one to just say? Clippers, maybe you might say Nuggets. You think Jamal Murray, that man. Yeah. Maybe the Thunder. What about, you think, what y'all think about the Timberwolves? Absolutely. About with Without Anthony Edwards, no, they need anything. That's, that's a lot. Towns, that's a lot Towns, 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 Towns yeah. got no plot. And Rudy Gobert, he's great defender, but mm. it don't translate in the right way. Yeah, and, yeah. He, he need, need a lot. Of sure. <laughs> 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 yeah, I feel like I'm missing somebody though. I feel like I'm missing a team. Okay, see, I miss. How would you, how would you feel about Shay leaving? But like the whole team still there. Oh, they need him. I don't know. They need I mean, him, but 30, they would still be competitive. I think thirty and night though. That's a big thirty one. It's thirty one and eight. Thirty one every time. Thirty one. <laughs> don't, don't you mess that up. Thirty one. My bad. Yeah, but Chet, Chet and Jalen Williams ain't nothing to play with either, though. They not, but like, I don't know. Are they going to win the championship? No, but there's nobody in the East. I'm, I'm actually looking at the standings now. Timberwolves no- Thunder. I don't know. No, Pel- what about Pelicans? What about Pelicans without I'm, Zion? Hell no. They ain't cooked them. I wouldn't even want to watch them. <laughs> Steph Curry? No, no Steph Curry on the Warriors? We've seen that before. 2020. Oh, yeah. And yeah, Draymond oh. can't carry. Um, the Cavs, I don't know what they got going. The Magic? Magic think, need every ounce of Paulo Benker. I, <laughs> I think, I think I'm, pick, I'm gonna pick the Kings. I think the Kings have such yeah. a well-oiled system. And Sabonis so is such a good player. If you just get a decent point guard, don't have to be like all, but just like a decent point guard. I think they overcome the Clippers' talent because the Clippers just have no plot. So I feel like I think the Kings and the well-oiled system and that Mike Brown offense. I think they. I'm picking the Kings. That's what I pick. Oh yeah, I'm picking the Clippers. Yeah, y'all ain't got no. Y'all ain't got no answers for James Harden. The only pe- the only person I can stop James oh, Harden. The playoffs is the playoffs. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing I can stop James Harden is a series. Um, <laughs> the only person that stop James Harden is a proven winner. It was a game golden, seven. That was the golden, the golden State Warriors. Outside oh. of the Golden State Warriors, who really, who really giving James Harden trouble for us? Scott Foster. Look, look, look at the Celt. I'm this ain't Rockets, James Harden. Look at the Celtics game he had last year. Look at the Heat game he had the year before, and look, look, look at all these losses. They're ridiculous. He had nine points in that game seven, bro. I said, bro, you don't have to be, you don't have to win, bro. Just put up like twenty five, like you know, what I'm saying, even if it's inefficient, like. Why do you have nine? Why in these closeout games you have sub ten points when you're James Harden? But yeah, in game man. one he had forty five, and in game seven he has nine. Like and bro, I'm, like it, I it get just goes that. down. I understand that, down. but when we talk about Philadelphia, every time, bro, every time we talk about Philadelphia, you're talking about you know, and be injured, and this is why he's not in my top five. Y'all here? Went right back to that. James, <laughs> Harden, went back to that. James Harden got the. <laughs> Put up 40 one night, and then we get mad. Why he ain't dropped 40 or 25 in game seven? There wouldn't be no game nine. seven. There wouldn't be no game seven if Embiid was healthy. But because but he he's not. Nine. I know. It's there, like, wouldn't, it's a- there wouldn't be no game seven if there wasn't that one. I'm saying, like, I'm not, I'm not saying that James Harden, you know. If you have to rely on James Harden to be your number one, bad things going to happen. I know. <laughs> I, I've lived it. <laughs> yeah, Almost but you, you can't give us good, and then when we, you know, you show us what you're capable of. The only thing that changed is the game. Like, it's game seven. It's, it's the most important game. And boy, you, you can and drop 45 on in game one. I mean, what's the point? If you're not translating into... And he had, like, opportunities. He had shots. He was just missing. Yeah, James Harden, yeah, James Harden reminds me of them niggas that would um just would be late to the start to like they would just miss the whole day. Like, bro, it's a star test, bro. 
Like you could literally <laughs> like we know that you can pass this test for real. You just did not show up today. Why didn't you? And he just shrugged his shoulders. I just didn't feel like it today. He gives you a little sponge about me. I didn't really feel like it. That's really what James Harden really be. That's why everybody be pissed off. I'm like, bro, like all you have to do is just be there. And you're not. So just just give me your average. That is the simplest thing you can ever ask a human. Just give me your average. I don't want you. You don't have to drop 60 or 50. Bro, you average 22. You average 25. You average 30. Bro, just do it again. <laughs> just please do it. If you if he did that, I promise I'd be a much happier person. I swear to you, I'd be a happier person in my life if this man did that. Just brought his average. <laughs> That's it. But, yeah, my man, my man went below nine points. It's like. What fifty percent below his average? Seventy percent below his average? Like that's come on now. I ain't gonna you get to that. That's funny though. <laughs> I bring back great memories. Ricio, I bring back a great memory when I played y'all, and I had he had eleven points in that game six. I said, bro, <laughs> this man, this man is like, what's happening, bro? Like, why you average twenty? Why now? <laughs> like, why not average? I put twenty nine in this game. <laughs> yeah, was that, that was that the game he got blocked. It's game five. That was a rough. That's that's he lost that game to the block, and then the next game he had his worst game of his life. I said that's that's a Merry Christmas to me. And then my uh, it went to the strip club afterwards. You, yeah. Um, that damn star He bought the ball on somebody. <laughs> oh my God. But this is what I'm gonna do. I, as y'all know, March Madness coming up. So we talking about NBA. We talking about our favorite moments we watch. And actually, before we do that, John, you did text me and you said that you had your favorite non NBA moment. So before we do this, which is related to NBA moments, uh, what is your favorite non NBA moment? It's, it's funny because we was actually just talking about it. It was oh, the Kawhi me. versus um, Philly. And see, I didn't ah. say Toronto. I said Kawhi because to me, yeah. he Hello. well. Nah, Fred, I think Fred went off that game. I mean, that series as well. But that shot was crazy. And I was watching it. Like, he had time to sit down and, like, process it. <laughs> I know. Hey, uh, Mauricio, were y'all rooting for him or rooting against him? Um, that, that was that was an interesting time because, like, he, he left in such weird terms because it wasn't, like, He's not the type of guy to just like, just be like, like blow it up on purpose or, but it was just like, it was so weird. The whole, I don't, I still don't even understand it to this day. So, but I mean, I was happy for the guy when, you know, when he won his chip with, uh, for with real? Toronto. That's I mean, not I, cap. No, nah, I mean, what, I mean, sure. We, we could have probably won more, uh, but then again, Golden State. Yeah, yeah Wemby now, so. Um, and yeah, everything everything leads to everything leads to plot. Everything, Boy, everything congratulations! Leads, you know, if you change one thing, you know maybe we don't have Wemby this year. Right? <laughs> I think it's better than me because I, I am sure we're moving for Harden. Skip ba- me too. I was not the way he left. Hell, you know. But look, Skip Ooh. Bayless. I might I might just Kawhi. be a different type of fan then. <laughs> remember, remember, Skip called quiet number two every time because look, LeBron went in the postseason. Skip needs someone else to hate on. So he found Kawhi, and every time number two would do something good, like that was the luckiest shot in history. Like he was <laughs> cooking, everybody kept winning and winning on his uh, way, called his man number two. But eventually, I mean, LeBron did have a lot of luck in that shot, too, though. It was uh, yeah, very was lucky, but that's it, it, it was so it was such a good moment because I was really rooting for both teams. So, like, it's the first time like, I watched the game where there's no bias, there's no agenda. Like, I really like Jimmy Butler, and that's when Jimmy Butler like stepped up and that's when he showed me, like, he, he can be the best player because the other dudes were selling. And Jimmy Butler was like, hold on, I got y'all. And, you know, and they had Ben, they had Embiid. And we got Embiid nice crying. <laughs> that was pretty funny. And Kawhi <laughs> just, had a I, mean, I had a moment. Had a and it was, it was great. Meme. You remember this? And that, that summer, everybody was getting eliminated by the Raptors. They would walk down that red tunnel. Like and be crying down the red tunnel. Giannis walking all straight and sad down the red tunnel. Steph Curry walking down. Everybody was walking down that red tunnel of doom. That that red tunnel to me was so iconic. And they made they put a Playboy Cardi like it's one of them sad Playboy Cardi songs. I forgot what the heck the name of the song is. I need to find it. was one of them sad Playboy Cardi songs. Everybody walking away all sad. But it is a hilarious. That's 
I shout out to Kawhi, bro. Um, that's funny because I'm like, looking right here. When this, this we're gonna do a tournament of best Ooh, NBA game fine. winners, <laughs> and we're, we're doing this tournament of best NBA game winners, and that and this man John talked about one of them that's on this. So we know the fun. winner. That man, he this bias went crazy, but <laughs> that man, I said, dang, this this man bias went crazy. Let's let's begin. We're gonna do a tournament. March Madness is coming up, so we're gonna do NBA best game winners. Let's hop right into this, gentlemen. Let's see. It's a round of thirty-two. Show my man Damian Lillard. If Austin was here, that's his favorite moment. So, and that all happened. That. The same. I hate that shot. <laughs> I love that shot, boy. That's Get the fire boys. shot right there. I ain't going. So okay, so looking at these two shots. I'm going to pause it. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but I don't like hearing that in my screen. Yeah. So we got the Russell Westbrook shot. This shot won him the MVP. Pissed me off. Um, <laughs> what is this shot, actually? What is this? Who did this? This is so old. Oh, this is Jerry West. Jerry, Jerry West. West man. Nah, him, him hitting a three to win is crazy. I, I'll get a Westbrook. I, I'm a hater. Or not a three? No, this this Jerry West. It was like a one-handed. Like, it was weird. They don't count this as a three, though, because this, this ah. was for the three-point line. So, cool. oh, they show me other stuff. Okay, they show me other stuff. So now, now we know we gotta go to this. Ha, <laughs> they show me other things. Let's move on. Um. Oh, this is. Oh, oh this Brandon is Brandon Roy, Roy versus the double. A. This clay Brandon Roy. Even though I'm like pissed because th- these things are biased towards me and I hate them, I, I pick Brandon Roy. What y'all think? Brandon Roy, Joe Johnson. Let me see. Let me see. Yeah. Oh my Ooh. God, that's oh, nasty! <laughs> wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, this was recent. This was like this. This is like ten. Oh, this is years like, oh my God, this yeah, Joe, Joe Johnson. Yeah, this is like ten years ago. Bro. Oh my goodness, he wins it. He I mean, well, he haven't retired that long ago. Huh? No, nah, not that long. But um, I mean, yeah, you could pick. You could like I picked Brandon Roy because yeah, I'm gonna go like the playoffs. Go. But you going Joe? Okay, I'm so that's go, one and one. Go Joe. Okay, Marisa, you you gonna type? We, like we got no chat, Ooh. so you got. <laughs> no time, so you gotta pick. Wait, let me see the Brandon Roy again. That thing, oh. that thing gonna hurt you. Now they took it away from me, bro. Oh, it, it's similar to the Lillard shot, though. It's similar to the Damian Lillard. Shot. Let's go with Johnson, man. <laughs> yeah, let's go with Johnson. That's better for me, anyways. It happened against me. Um, speaking of Damian Lillard, oh the this, water. oh this is the hard, this is the hard one, boy. Oh, oh. A LeBron against Toronto with the one hand. Nice. We all remember the Lillard. So what's the what's the, Lillard one? One. the LeBron one? This, it's LeBron Toe. Yeah, LeBron Toe, watch this. But I said, dang, Toronto really got no plot. That's tough. This is one of the tough ones, too. Offhand, game winner. Oh, I remember that. Bang. I'm, I'm going to give it to Dane. I'm because, giving it to Dane. Yeah, it was like, that was more impactful to me. The Dane one was way more impactful. than It was a deep-ass three. I say this one is really good. I'm going to pick this one because I saw this live. But this one, when LeBronto was created, it's a very iconic moment. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead. Actually, Maurice, yeah. I didn't get your point. No, what, I was going to pick Dame, yeah. too. Oh, they got, they got me. I, Tyreek, Evans is, Tyreek Evans is really good. But this, the, the one on the no, right is just Curry. Clock. It's Steph Curry. It's first out of five. Yeah. It's that, shot right, that shot right there <laughs> reminded, like, I was convinced that that shot was like, oh, man, like, this OKC Warriors rivalry, this is gonna be on. It's gonna be going for like <laughs> years. It's gonna be going <laughs> for five, six years. I was convinced. <laughs> Wait, was the score tied? Uh huh. Oh, uh, were they down? No, no. I think they were down. I think they were down. I think they were down. I think they're down like one or two. So yeah. this was a ridiculous no. shot. This was a ridiculous shot because I'm like, why would he take such a deep three? But then he realized he's a main character. At this point, when I saw this, like, oh, he's a main character. Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember That's watching the game yeah. when he hit it. I'm like, damn. And that's when I and that really solidified his his unanimous MVP too. That's the craziest thing. I'm picking this. This plot yeah, crazy. This is minus this. Yeah. Yeah. this Tyreek Evans is very impressive, but this is this plot. And funny, Tyreek Evans won Rookie of the Year over Steph Curry. Fun fact. That mm. is crazy. <laughs> yeah, a random fun fact. <laughs> oh, this is oh, this is a good one. Ooh. Oh, this is this, this, this is a really good. Hey, guys, no, I'm wait, picking wait, Jordan. Let me see the Kobe. Kobe. Oh my God, Kobe. The, because one was, was a, one was a foul, an offensive foul. The other one was... Oh, this man, hey, Jordan. I remember he buys hey, Jordan. But, <laughs> but listen <laughs> to Kobe. So Kobe does two. He does one. They, they, I guess they count both of them. He did one to tie the game in regulation. He, he down. Oh, they showed me the whole game, boy. I, oh, my gosh. They showed me the whole game, boy. I, I ain't trying to watch the six-minute clip of this. <laughs> mm. um, Is that a match? Yeah. Yeah, it's a match. 
Oh, so I'm this, tripping. I thought he was on the Lakers. I was like, what's going that, on? That's him tying the game, and then let's hear the game winner. So the game winner, so he they win the tip off, and over time, Kobe gets the ball. Kobe looks, looks, fades away over two mm. people. Over two. Oh, yeah. Over two. And, and over. Does, what? What? Are we including, like, because, I mean, obviously, the one on right is, like, super iconic, but. It's the most iconic possible. For, I mean, if you, like, just, if you like the what, Kobe what? one. You, huh? If you feel like Kobe's was, I don't know, because it could be, is it difficulty? Is it, like, iconic? Like, it's whatever you feel. Like, which which one do you prefer? Man, I'll tell you the context, though. I'm, I'm going to go Kobe, because the other one, to me, hey. was the foul, so. Kobe, he blew it out. bro. Kobe. Look, he, he blew a 3-1 lead in that series. I ain't going to lie to you. I just thought it, that's his <laughs> win, and he lost three straight games after that, and that was it. <laughs> so I just, I ain't going to lie to you. That's why I was like, context. I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. Man, when you ask I mean, one one like, in and a chip, really one in and I'm like, how y'all choosing Kobe? I'm t- hey, well, this man game the playoffs. Fast, so if you're wondering why I chose Kobe, there you go. Jordan so, won the championship off yeah. that, and Kobe won a game to blow three straight after. So that's why I say, but Reese, how you feel? <laughs> I'm gonna pick based off the shot only, no okay. context behind it, and I, I'm gonna take Kobe. See, I, man, I know boy, that hurt Jesse. I know, thank Jordan, boy. I. Right. That's crazy, Jordan. Eliminate this Jordan yeah. shot. Eliminate so early in the first people. round. Get him Bro, out of here. Yeah. In the first round, crazy eliminate Jordan, boy. But I feel it. Um, Durant winner in OKC or Tony Kukoc. Um, Durant. Oh, Tony. This Tony Kukoc one was hilarious because uh, Scotty Pippen did not get the ball. If you watch the one, Scotty but, Pippen shot but, but couldn't get it. Thank you. Um, and he started like he didn't even get into the game. He didn't even check into the game. And Phil Jackson started cussing him out and was like this and that because he wanted the shot, but Kukoc in anyway, so he was still pissed because he a bad I'm, teammate. I think I'm gonna reward a temper tantrum, bro. Give that to Durant. <laughs> give it. Right, to- let's, look at Dur- let's, look, let's look at Durant again. I gotta look at Durant again. That was a tough. That was a tough three. I remember that one. I watched that live. Did they lose this series? They won a series. I think they probably won a series. They won this. Yeah, they won a series. That was a good shot. Uh, I might give it to Durant actually. Yeah, mm-hmm. I'm going Tony. Mauricio, you do what you going? I'm going Durant on this one. Absolutely. I feel like Mauricio, you always gonna be the tiebreaker, but you're never gonna make it two two. You always gonna make it three one somewhere. <laughs> I think you always you're never gonna like tie it. That's hilarious. Um, <laughs> let's look. So we have oh, that one's crazy. I'm actually I'm likely putting the some dude clock to some down. dude. Some dude. Don't even know that man name. Don't, don't even know that man name. I'm gonna show I'm gonna show y'all again. Let's, let's look at the Maryland mir- miracle for Jeff Malone. Let's see. Um. Okay. No, wide open and it should. <laughs> no, it, it, it's, it, it gotta be something else. It gotta be something else. It gotta be something else. It gotta be this. It gotta be something else. Because there's no way that's the. There's no yeah, way. Right. Yeah, they, that was just a regular. No. <laughs> there's a wide open three. Like that's not gonna be on. <laughs> <laughs> so my man shooting free. We get all the context. I'm just gonna watch this whole li- this whole clip. Ooh, I'm watching all this. You missed it. That's that's missed the free throw. Missed it. Mm-hmm. That bench. <laughs> you that bench shooting free throws. What you missed both. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh wow. What's the shot? Let's see. This is the shot. Well, no look pass. Oh, oh right oh, out of that. Wow. Oh, oh, you out of miles with that. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay. Let me hey, chill out. Right. My fault. Okay. okay. Nah, that I, was a, I wasn't familiar with your game. <laughs> that's hilarious. Nine, oh, is that 19? Oh, that's 10 minutes. Oh, they're not going to. I don't know where that's at. Yeah. Oh, no. I, I found it. I found it. I found it. I found it. I think. Some dude like right it down. I, I believe. <laughs> I believe Some dude is crazy. crazy. Okay. Go back a little more. Go back, go for it. I don't know. I, I can't. Got you fine. working. Yeah. I, where the heck is that? Oh, it's right, it's right there. It's right there. More I back. I found it. I found it. Okay. Some dude is crazy. So they're going to show Jordan, and they're going to show Jordan. That, that, that's going to be on his list for sure. Let's see. This is the shot. Right. So, all right. Let me show it up. Oh, it's, so he, he got it blocked. He regained it and then shot yeah, it again. Maybe. Oh, replay. Wow. Ooh, that's blocked, crazy. That's crazy. It. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, that, I, that's cool. crazy. I like the I, I like the Maryland one. I ain't gonna lie. That was cool, I guess, but <laughs> he said, I, I was guess running to the side and I mean that's that Kawhi that Kawhi esque. Like that was more like look. The other one seemed like he used more skills in it. Oh, I feel yeah, you. That's I, a good point. I, will, I might yeah, I might, go with too. I might go with I'm, 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 I'm gonna go with the some dude. I like some dude. <laughs> I mean, I blocked to hit a shot. Wow, what a world! All right, and in, take, in typical fashion, I'm gonna make I'm gonna make it three one. Of course, you will, Maryland boy. Maryland, take it home. Sorry, what some dude. Side? like that's that was Curry. Like, oh that my gosh, it, 
yeah, Devin Booker was great, but of course it's the one on the right. Like it's oh, it's definitely Dame. Yeah, yeah. it's definitely the one. Like he Devin not, Booker was he cool. Not, he knocked somebody out the playoffs with that shot. Me. But, <laughs> uh, <laughs> these boys they were he made great, me, great, great. he made me hate Chandler Poisons moving forward. Oh, for that was his defensive assignment. And he fell asleep at the wheel. No, but he left. Chandler Parsons left the year like he went and to, then went to the Mavericks. We got Trevor Reese though. We got four years, four years on Reese. It was pretty good four years, even though the plot ended bad at the end. True. Um, I'll give it Damon Lillard. Yeah, um, Devin Booker, Damon. the Suns they went eight and zero in the post in this yeah. bubble and didn't make the playoffs. But the next year they made it to the finals. So good thing. Yep. Good, good, good omen for them. Um, LeBron. Oh, the LeBron was fire. I think I'm gonna give it to LeBron. But Rasheed Wallace. Oh! Is I, I I get to that LeBron one, bro. That's it's, it's definitely LeBron. Yeah, it's LeBron. I do not care about no Rasheed Wallace, bro. <laughs> I don't want to. Right. Yeah, get it. How y'all feeling? LeBron, it is. LeBron. Yeah, LeBron. Yeah, that, that LeBron shot is very iconic. They lost that series still, though. That's tough. Um, Dwayne Wade in double overtime. Oh, it's Reggie Miller. No, Dwayne Wade's fire. Actually, I don't know because Reggie Miller is more iconic, but Dwayne Wade probably is more fire to look at. Reggie Miller is more iconic because he pushes like Michael Jordan like very far. That's a clear foul. And runs, hits the three, and does a twirl jump like he just did right there. But oh, oh, oh man, wow. <laughs> this man is hilarious. Crazy. Uh, let's look at Dwayne Wade. Let's look at him. That's an interesting angle. Did they put that angle because they know his plot? Like the, you know, they didn't put it the regular, the regular like sideway angle. They put it the other way because they know he's gonna make it or something. I don't know. People, they already know. Oh. And Reggie Miller. A complete push off. Let's see. Let's look. I, I just had to look at him because it's, it's funny to see. And Michael is just chasing him. Like, right. Move on my way. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> and bang. I don't know. Uh to me, like if the game is tied, if you're down, I give that more credit. So I'm gonna go with Reggie. When the game is tied and you it's not that it's not impressive, it's just like it's less you miss, so what? <laughs> yeah. Let's go to OT. I, I'm, I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick Reggie Miller. The yeah, push is hilarious. I love that push. It's it's a hilarious thing to do. I'm gonna go Reggie yeah. as well. Reggie, Reggie. Sorry, Dwayne. All right. Next round, we got Kyrie Irving. This guy wins. It's Kyrie. I'm not even looking. I, I, I'm sorry. I, like we good. We, we're moving on, right? We're moving on. I'm gonna. I'm gonna press. Yeah. I'm, I'm a... sorry. <laughs> like I'm sorry. Let, let's move quickly. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Ameka Okafor. I've heard that name in a hundred years. The Mar- the Marshall Rose is back to back game winners. He did that randomly like two years ago. He had back to back buzzer beaters. Um, oh, yeah, that's I'm the only one. Demar, I don't remember the other one. I'm gonna go Demar as well. Results matter. Forcing yeah, OT versus winning a game. I'm going. I'm going game. Yeah, yeah. Manuel Mudiay's only good moment <laughs> in Denver. Good for him. Look at him, man. He almost broke his body, and. Who's Milk Palacio? Boy, that's in a different world right now. Who the heck is Milk like Palacio? Never heard of them. <laughs> they are, but like, it's, a, it's, a, it's a different world. Boy, this ain't the Celtics I know. We're KG and oh. Ray Allen, but who Milk Palacio? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm, I'm going to pick. Uh, I don't know. I'll pick Moutier. Moutier, probably. Yeah. Indifferent, honestly. Yeah, like, yeah, it's just like. You ain't I don't about know to win anyway. I'm like, yeah, y'all finna get knocked out very soon anyway. Yeah. Oh, the, it's point four. Ooh. I'm gonna let you. Oh, 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 I gotta go. Fish, I fish, I gotta put point four. Though. Point yeah, four nah, is a crazy. Because that was after that was after Tim Duncan hit something like crazy, crazy. Oh, well, we know who Tim, Mauricio chooses. <laughs> Tim Duncan hit something crazy. My granny was going like, crazy. Yeah, I remember crazy. that. I gotta go. He said, "Get off." Mm. Made it okay. I'm running. I'm in the locker. No one see me. I'm running. I'm gone. I don't yeah. don't review it. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm gone. So I'm picking Derek Fisher. Uh, well, it doesn't matter what I pick. I think. <laughs> oh, I thought you said Durant, but well, we still want to know who you, who you got. I just honestly like don't don't, don't even think about it. Um, the rich. I mean, they're they're similar type shots. I guess. Are they really? <laughs> this one won the playoff game. Gang got these boys. Let's just, let's just move on. Let's just move on. You know what you do. <laughs> you don't have to say it. Derek Fisher did it. All right. Uh, Boren. Oh, Baron. I said Boren. Baron Davis drains the game winner. And Rob, it's Robert, to me, it's Robert Ory. That's that's the personification of plot. 
like the ball just bounced right back to Robert Ory against the Kings. Is I just I picked that for sure. But all right, take your word for it. Um, he's not gonna win, so I don't mind using Ori. Mm. I think it's a basic three pointer. I know, Steph but it's like it's that all the time. It's the fact that Vlade Divac, instead of like trying to rebound the ball, just passed it back to like someone else essentially, and it got an open three. It's just it's just plot driven. That's fair. Um, Kobe Kobe Guzzer beater on Dwayne Wade versus Kobe on oh why did show Dave? Oh, this is a second. We in another round. I guess we're in the next round. Oh, um, no, it's the same round. It's the last. Oh, I think it's the last one in the. In the they gave Derek game. Fisher two of them. Good for him, bro. That man Risa can't escape it. That's hilarious. Oh I'm gonna my. give it to Kobe just. For, I'll give it to Kobe just because Derek Fisher already got got one. Yeah, I, I'm I'm leaning towards That's... Kobe because he did that over D Wade. Yeah, a great defender. Good job, Marisa. Get him out the way. <laughs> Russell Westbrook versus Steph Curry. You know I'm picking. Steph Curry. F that. Not even. Ooh, yeah. It's just Steph. Haha. F, <laughs> F that. Steph Curry. John, how you feeling? No, yeah, I'm taking Curry. I don't really remember the Westbrook one like that. I know it needs to. Um, LeBron versus Reggie. Ooh, Ooh. Cool. actually, I think LeBron. LeBron James, casual. LeBron. LeBron. Do I, I like LeBron, LeBron or do I want to see more MJ slander by picking Reggie? I'm totally <laughs> flexed. I still might go Bron, but damn. Reggie was a push off, so I ain't gonna lie. I might, I might lean a little more. I might. Yeah. Maybe. Le- uh, I'll go with LeBron. I'm not mad if Reggie ends up getting picked, but just I'm picking, I'm picking LeBron. I think that that shot is very iconic. They both lost this series anyway, so it's like, yeah. You're right. John, how you feeling? Oh, I'm, I'm going Reggie. We want to get LeBron on here, but LeBron moving on. Um, Joe Johnson. Versus, oh, the, it's that, uh, it's the, you know, that shot, the crazy shot with the side yeah, shot. Yeah, I'm yeah. picking Maryland, yo. Yeah, I'm picking Maryland, yeah. Yeah, Maryland, too. Maryland, I'm Maryland. Maryland, Maryland. Hey, we may have a winner on our hand. <laughs> Kyrie versus the point four shot. Derek, I know who you picking for. Derek Fisher, you know who you picking. I'm picking Kyrie, man. I'm picking Derek Fisher, yo. I'm not lying. Oh, man, Derek. Point hey, four this, is this really a tough one because. Now, I'm I'm going Kyrie because I remember watching that game and it's like Curry had a shot. He had a chance to go down there and hit a and I'm like, Curry, how you can't hit the three, but you got Kyrie hitting it. So that was crazy. I'm going with Kyrie. Kyrie as well. Here. People talk more about the LeBron block than that Kyrie shot. So I'm I'm gonna go D fish. That's only because always- it's LeBron. But without that shot, I mean it was such an impactful shot though. That's, that's, that's the biggest shot in the history of Cleveland sports. Yeah. Man, I'll tell you that. That that's not saying a lot. It's Cleveland sports, but <laughs> I, I, that shot, I do want the best thing. <laughs> hey, I'm just like, we about the game feeling though. Like I, I picked Kyrie. Put so much pressure on on Curry and Curry didn't deliver. So tough. You got no pl- well, no, he got plot. I'm talking about um, the Martin Rosen game winner. So back to back game winners or the Robert Ory open shot when plot just went his way. Mm-hmm. Um, to Robert back. Ory. I'm gonna give it to Demar. Demar. That is a basic ass Robert Ory three pointer. I know. It's, I'm, I'm looking at impact. Just the fact that like they won the series from stuff like that, bro. And it right. was terrible. It was a terrible closeout. Anyway. And John, was, who you picking? Oh, I'm going Demar. I feel it. I feel you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my Robert. gosh! Damn, I don't even want. I don't even want to see yeah. that in your movie. <laughs> yeah. Get that man off my screen. Um, oh, I feel this. like it's this. Ooh. I feel like it's this. Back to back, Dame. I think. I think Ooh. he got that. Yeah, I think it is Dame. Unfortunately, the Dame. Yeah. Unfortunately, I was. I was rooting for Dame. Think it's Dame. That's a crazy word, my boy. Marisa, who you picking? Uh, Dame. And I and like know. Paul George said, I don't care. It was a bad shot. Interesting. Kobe versus Kobe. Is this Kobe? Y'all eliminated Jordan. I remember y'all eliminated Jordan so fast for no reason. <laughs> but yeah, it's Kobe versus Kobe. I, I'm picking this Kobe, even though he blew a 3 1 lead right after. But this Kobe against Dwayne Wade's regular season game. I don't know. I think this was more iconic. Yeah, I'm going to go with the yeah. more iconic one. Yeah. I, I'll agree with that. I agree. Yeah. Oh, we in a yeah. we we in the conference finals right now, boy. Steph. Oh my gosh. Oh, we got a little harder one now. We got the plot shot. <laughs> That's why I call it the plot shot. Or you got this Dame Lillard beating me. Beat. 
I hated both of these moments too. That's the thing. So, but the I one with Curry, one. it like he didn't win a series or nothing, right? It only took it to like the next game. I know that was just a regular season. Game. It was the regular season. It was the regular season. It was just such an iconic. It's literally it's probably it just the most solidified iconic regular season game. It just solidified his unanimous MVP. Like at that point, it's like yo, <laughs> nobody is winning MVP but Steph Curry in 2016. Because of and that, LeBron tweeted out. I remember LeBron tweeted out today. He was that after that game, he's like, "Bro, Steph Curry changing the game." I was like, "Bro, that is the most iconic regular season game in the last 15, 20 years." Versus Dame, mm. oh my gosh, I mean, fourteen year curse. Damn, I gotta give it to Dame. I'm not mad at that, but I, I do. Sorry, I, I, I did watch that game with Curry, so I do remember. The and and this is the double it bang. Was, too. Remember, it was crazy. I remember the double bang. Who who did he shoot over? It was number fourteen, right? What was his name? I have no clue. Yeah, so he shot over everybody. The fact you shoot that deep, like, there's no <laughs> kind of looking. Don't even know. I remember. He said, <laughs> "Bang, bang!" <laughs> oh, probably Robertson, Robertson or something Robertson. like that. That trash ass boy. He was a good defender though. I'm what what was his name? Was Andre um, Robertson. Andre Robertson. Yeah. Oh, Robertson. Yeah, I remember him. Like, who y'all picking? I, there's one Curry and one Lillard. I think. Dang, that's tough. Tough. I really don't remember the Lillard one that much. I do. What hurt me? That was that. Yeah, that was the first Lillard one. Mm, I still might go stuff, but Appreciate I do like the stuff one too. It's Appreciate not an easy don't, one. Don't, don't be as easy. Uh, like, tell me what's up with your three one self. Maybe two two. Let's see. I'm gonna take Steph on this one. I mean, he's the ultimate tiebreaker, boy. There's never been no deadlock with his man. I love it. <laughs> his man says there's no deadlocks with me. Whoever got two, oh, one, you chose Steph it. too. Yeah, you chose Steph. Yes. Okay, we gonna move. We gonna move on. Yeah, I chose Steph. Um, we are gonna move on quickly. Kyrie. Very quickly. All right, we move on quickly. Dang, quickly. Jamar made it far. I <laughs> <laughs> made it far. Maryland. 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 I picked. Le- I picked LeBron. I'm Maryland. going Maryland, bro. That I told you, man. Maryland. That was the skills. Maryland won the old championship. I'm going to have to look that dude up. Wait, why isn't Kawhi shot in these? That is a very good I, question. Because it's but look, easy look, to... I'm not even mad at that because that makes it too that's, easy. That, that is okay. That's fair. That's fair. Now, nah, we really we really voted uh, the last shot off. That's crazy. That's crazy, boy. They <laughs> voted that man off in the first round of Marta Rose in this deep. That's funny. That's hilarious. <laughs> you need it. You need, you need <laughs> Jordan Love is in here. Shit crazy. Reese, Reese, who you figure, bro? That's funny. That's, that's the most iconic shot in that man's life. And that man got bought off immediately. Um, immediately. I'm picking the Maryland Miracle. Oh, Man. my gosh. Mr. 3-1. <laughs> you didn't want to come my way, huh? I don't even do it on purpose. I forgot who y'all picked. Uh, Damian. Oh, this is oh, this is a good one. A good one. That's probably Kobe's most iconic shot, to be honest. Versus I'm Damian going Lillard. Going Damian. That that wave was crazy. That day he said bye bye, bro. Like, like they was talking the whole game. Look how much fun they having. And he did drop fifty on him. I remember the the game of, like before they lost, and they said uh, somebody was talking to Lillard. Lillard was like, "I'm gonna eliminate these mfers tomorrow." Like he was like pissed because Westbrook was talking a lot. He's I'm gonna eliminate these mfers tomorrow. And he dropped fifty in a game winner buzzer beater. I said, "Boy, he got good That's first fire. round plot." <laughs> he got that good first round plot. <laughs> I remember Russ hit a three, and he was pointing at it. He was like. Yeah, motherfucker. I was like, damn, Russ, like, bro, chill. <laughs> Act like you've been here before. <laughs> and he that started man. rocking the baby. And, bro, that, that was just, it was just sad. That was sad. And then the How next year, I was, which year they lost to Donovan Mitchell? Was it the year, year before, before that or the year after? Uh, year before. The year before. Year before. Yeah, they, year they before. went out sad, like, multiple years. That's they right. went out sad a lot. And I was laughing the entire time. <laughs> Um. So wait, we have what we have. We have um, one. So I, I'll I pick think Dame. I'm picking Dame. Dame is. I one. think it's yeah. I'm picking Dame. Bye bye. Unanimous Kobe. decision. There you go, Kobe. I'm sorry. So what? what and we, okay, so we're biased because we we're in the yeah. Kyrie. No, you can't. No, look. Maryland. Yeah, come on. This is where it ends, boy. F Maryland, boy. This guy. <laughs> it was a good. It was a good run. <laughs> I'm going Kyrie, boy. Well, I mean, barely, can't barely, barely too fast you. now. I'm, I'm going Kyrie, but you know what I'm saying? I mean, Maryland. I had to watch it one last time. That Maryland shot crazy. That man living off Maryland, but Maryland won a whole championship, boy. You need, we stay, need to figure I'm out who on Maryland. I'm going to stick beside him. Damn, I hey, wish Jeff I had Malone. This, you ain't got no context on the Maryland one? 
<laughs> I don't, but that sounds like a regular game, boy. But Jeff Malone, <laughs> shout out to you, man. <laughs> oh man, yeah, it's probably. I mean, uh, it's, it's Kyrie for real. Uh, I'm not mad at it. So, so uh, Marisha, I, I know. Are you picking? What you picking? Oh, uh, Kyrie. He picked Kyrie. Three one. There you go, Maryland. See, hey, hey, John. His name Jeff Malone. Look him up. You be buy him buy a jersey, boy. Y'all need to buy this man jersey. I think right now, man. Cause that's crazy. Um, we have Dame Lillard versus Steph Curry. Oh my gosh, what a matchup! Dame Lillard, Dame. <laughs> it is Dame. Oh man, y'all beating the plot shot, huh? He, he sent, the plot he shot. sent them home. He sent them boys home. Reach how you feel? This is this one's. Oh man, um, sent them home or won a unanimous MVP. The plot Revolution shot, boy. I, I pick. I, I pick. Uh, I don't know, boy. I might pick Curry, but I'm sorry. That that bang, that double bang, crazy, bro. That was the most shocking thing. Not the most shocking thing, but I was like, it's Mike Breen that makes it for me, bro. Like Mike Breen is just like cooked so well in that moment. That's, That's like sent great. shockwave. Uh, damn, I'm a. I think I'm gonna go with with Steph on this one. Two two. two, two. <laughs> How we break this? We got a tiebreaker. I might flip. A, I might do one of them things. You flip a. We're gonna have to call somebody. <laughs> we have to, we have to call somebody. <laughs> or you could, if you have easy right, access. Austin. to someone. He seemed to be. Super, well, we already know his answer. That man also gonna heard. pick. <laughs> that man gonna pick Damian Lillard <laughs> and <laughs> call it a day. <laughs> we I already know his answer. <laughs> I'm gonna do that flip a coin thing. I'm. A, I don't know if y'all want me to share my screen for like. We, um, we should. We should. Um, like give our reasons and then see. I feel like we can change Mauricio mind. <laughs> I'm really just saying, bro. He sent a team home and had somebody salty and say, "Yo, that's a bad shot." I don't care. Nobody. nobody. I say, the reason I picked Steph Curry is because that shot to me is like the like the rift moment of just like everyone is now transitioning. Like when he hit that shot. That's like it sent shock waves in the NBA. Like, oh my gosh, everyone's shooting threes. Or he's not. He's shooting threes deep. We need to start shooting threes to keep up with this. They're on about to win 70 games, et cetera, et cetera. So the next year, everybody started shooting threes more. And that's just like the shock wave moment. That's like, there's like, there's like a moment. It's like a chapter. Like you change like the beginning of a new chapter. Yeah. That's what I say. Like Dame that, Lillard. That, that's how like, I feel about the shot. Yeah, too. so he, he passed the torch to Lillard. And that's why he took the shot <laughs> way back there. <laughs> that, 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 that was a game winning shot. Like where he shot it from, was a, it was a bad shot. Series winner. Thank he you. stepped. He did like a step back, like side step. He wasn't even by the three point three, and it was over Paul George, a look, great. Look, they, look, they, well, somebody. I, I mean, Robertson, a great defender. I mean, Robertson, a great. P? Robertson is a really good defender. Yeah, but he this wasn't is even too. like look this at him. He, he didn't. He wasn't even like planning to guard him. Because like, no one, that's Paul that's George what he was like he, he, like he was already I don't know what is it called I don't not boxed out but he was already like turned around like the position of the like he pulled his yeah. shorts up like he was ready to you know to actually guard Lillard uh he was running True. backwards and he just happened like he like damn is is he really about to shoot this but I feel like moments like this created this because the fact that this this is why I say this is why I say the shot this this that moment like him doing this it made Dane probably think you know. Mm. Just because you start did it first, I mean you did it better. Cook, look, Dame Lillard, that boy, that boy Steph Curry, Steph Curry did it right. Damian Lillard said, "You know, I need to do what he did." This is how iconic the shot is. He's like, "I need, I need to do this myself because of the fact that he just randomly pulled up." Because the reason why this man is not in <laughs> position really to guard him is because no one expected that to even like. No one. This is like people. When D- Dame did this a couple times in the series, like so, people. That's why Paul George is in position because he's like, and this this is a tie game too. So it's not like like Johnny said about tie games. This game's tied. So if he misses, it's like whatever. This I shot, don't know. They, they, I'm pretty sure the game was tied with Curry too. Was it tied? I don't know. I'm pretty. I'm, pretty I'm like. I will. If I had to bet, it's a 50 50 bet. But I'm pretty sure the game was tied when he hit it. This is the only thing. He, he wouldn't have shot it. Go ahead, cook, Rich, <laughs> He Greg wouldn't have Cook, shot I feel like that. He's it up. Honestly, he wouldn't have shot that, bro. I'm no, I'm willing to bet the game was tied. I don't think so, though. I mean, look, you, you, may, you may be right, but I don't think so. I really think. What, what do y'all do? Y'all see it? I'm pulling it up right now. Trust me, he, the game was tied. I, I guarantee you. I don't. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. The only thing that will sway me, which one of these shots has a better chance to go up against that Kyrie shot in the finals? 
Because that's what okay. it's going to be. The no, game look, wait, wait. was tied. Yeah, we so, got our winner. Oh, they don't, I mean, they're both tied. We talk about this. Yeah, they were they both tied. Yeah, it's Dave. It's Dave. Dave. No, because you you try to use it like you no, you try to use I, it against me and it backfires. So I, I try to use it. I thought it could be an advantage, but since it's not advantage, it went right back to the status quo. I let my advantage went right back to where we are right now. Just tied. <laughs> yeah, but tied. okay, if you want to use that, then let's add more context. One was to win a series in the playoffs. The other one was a regular season game, and it changed the NBA. I say that's what I'm saying. It changed the NBA. That's what it I'm saying. Already that's changing not... the NBA. That that one no, shot didn't necessarily. But think of all the shots Steph Curry's taken in his life. That's the one you remember the most, and that's the he's the greatest shoot ever. I think that's the shot. That, you look at this. Look at this game. Look at how many people watch this game. Look at how many people watch the the game. Look at how many people. There's like a clip. The whole YouTube. The whole game's up on YouTube. Look how many views that has. Look how many views that shot has. That is the shot. That shot is the shot that to me changed. Okay, like everyone it... took. Oh, this this guy is like we got our winner then. Let's let's whichever one has more views, that's the winner. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, I'm gonna look it up on YouTube. Check, check him out. Whichever one has more <laughs> views, that's the winner. I'm looking up Steph Curry. Now this does it have to be posted by let's like, say NBA or just let's, let's, by the NBA. NBA. or like whoever has more views, whichever shot has more views. So like, if, if there's two of them, the ones for Curry. Whichever one you can find with the more views, let's just go with that. All right, so okay. Curry's. Uh, if it's just the video of just the shot, that's yeah. four million views. Mm -hmm. Okay, look at and and then, Dame. Oh, but the full highlights is he has seventeen million. Yeah, the full highlights is. That's so crazy! Like, he has seventeen million freaking views on some highlights. On highlights. I Steph have never gonna, seen Steph that. is going to win the popularity contest. It's Steph Curry. Dang, I know Dame's video. Dame, he had five. Dame's video of just the shot. So if we're comparing just the shot for shot videos, Dame has 5.6. So he does beat Curry. There you go. Hey, give it to you. Then. Mm -hmm. I, I'm a man of my word. That man, hey, the plot shot was, but hey, I'll give it to you, Ray. That was a good little debate. We going on. And look, look, he's waving by the curry. Bye bye. <laughs> hey, but it's it's the conference finals, so it, it makes sense, right? I'm giving this to Kyrie after Dame shot now since I lost. I'm giving it right to Kyrie. So I actually think Kyrie is. I'm. I was always gonna pick Kyrie. Like it's Kyrie. Early. I'm like, picking Dame. Of course, of course. You gotta pick Dame. I feel you. I'm. I'm picking Kyrie. Oh my gosh, John! I know he's gonna write the name too. We gonna do another one. Nah, I'm going Kyrie. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, man, the, the impact of that shot. Remember, I don't like the Lillard shot. I told you, Paul George, that's my boy. That's the best. But he said, I, I can buy it sometimes. That's fair. Hey, let me ask y'all: if the Kyrie shot went against the Kawhi Leonard shot, who would win that one? Kawhi. Kawhi. That's a crazy shot. That shot was just now Kawhi I mean, versus Maryland. Eight. <laughs> now that's the championship. That's, your, that's your Jeff Malone should have made that championship win. <laughs> now, Kawhi, Kawhi popped a squat, and like there's beautiful artwork made of him just like looking at his shot about to bounce in. That is so iconic. Yeah, that's one of the greatest game winners of all time. All right, but man, Kyrie Irving, boy, you got it, boy. So Kyrie Irving, I I, I ain't ex speaker for me. Ex Kyrie Irving <laughs> is our. NBA champion. He beat Damian Lillard. Damian Lillard made it far. Jeff Malone made it very far. Um, shout out to Jeff Malone. That Maryland shot. Every time I put something against Maryland, they said, no, Maryland. 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 Every single time. It was like, nah, I can never get it. Um, I tried to get the plot shot, but they, they wouldn't let me get the plot shot. Um, so, yeah. That is our tournament. And we'll definitely you, do more. If of you these. scroll down, you can see the results and what most people chose. You know, I don't know if, if I you look at this, already. I did. Well, no, I, I see it. Most people, they showed Kawhi but Kawhi wasn't on this, so he must have updated it to make it not easy. Um, the last shot of the Bulls was another one. The fact that that got eliminated in the first round, crazy. That clearly should have been a top four, but that's that's interesting. And the Kyrie Irving clutch game three point winner is also a very popular one. So yeah, those are the top top three. But yeah, so we'll definitely do more of these. Um, it's, it is March Madness, so we'll do more of these tournaments to see who we believe is the best. Um, one day we'll do a two K one. I definitely want to do two K one, but they ain't play a lot two K. So I'm gonna have to get some 2K people because I gotta do this. I gotta do 2K because a lot of them songs is nostalgic, beautiful nostalgia. But yeah, hey, 
for more content like this, you know, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Like I said, we are on the road to 700 subscribers. Um, we're trying to be putting in content on a daily. I'm grinding in March, boy. All the content and next week's free agency. So next week's an NFL podcast. Oh my gosh! <laughs> next week is an NFL podcast, and it's gonna be fun. He's gonna, we're gonna have fun with that one. So hey, make sure to tune in for that one as well. And yeah, hey, we are gonna catch you guys. And before I go, Greg. Quick, you got to shout out to, you know, Greg, he has a platform as well. Shout, shout out what you do real quick. Uh, yeah. If y'all want to uh, follow follow me and my guy, Jax, uh, the Play for Keeps pod on all platforms. Play number four keeps podcast. Uh, we we drop things for the casual fan only. I mean, if you're if you're if you're a student of the game, you know, we love you, too. But this is this is for the for the NBA, NFL you know, casual college football, casual because casual fans matter too. Casual fans make up what you know what what our sport is. So you, you want to talk hoops? Come over on this side. Come to the dark side, man. Come over to death row. That's a good slogan, right, boy? Casual fans matter too, boy. That's that's a slogan. This fan, this vibe for the casuals. I like that. <laughs> so I'll put that link in the description and make sure to check them out, man. And hey. We're going to catch you guys on the next podcast, and we are out of here. Peace.